Uh, what else is going on? Um, Israel's Israel's strike on Iran. Uh, supposedly they were they were going to do three waves of attacks, and after the first wave, uh, they realized that Iran's defenses were extremely powerful, and they couldn't penetrate. So I'm guessing they called back a lot of their uh, fighters. Uh, they weren't able to hit any major bases. Unfortunately, like two or three people, uh, Iranian soldiers were killed. Um, and we'll see if Iran retaliates. In my humble opinion, uh, enough time should not be given to Israel or the United States and the UK and the backers of this genocide of what's happening in the Middle East, uh, of this aggression towards World War III and progression towards world war three i don't think the acts of resistance should give israel or the united states any breathing room not that i'm pro, pro war pro violence uh, but i think if they're allowed to adjust their attack based on the defenses that they're facing then it's going to continue to escalate to a nuclear level to almost a nuclear level what nuclear level right i think if the acts of resistance hits hard fast hard relentless because that's what you need to do bullies if you ever encounter a bully this is my personal experience you you do you i do me but my personal experience is that if you ever encounter bullies and you have no choice but to confront them you annihilate them you go fucking eight ship eight shit on them and make sure they go down on their knees and they do not get up and they remember that event for the rest of their lives and that is exactly what needs to happen to zionist israel uh, otherwise we're going nuclear okay it's the same sentiment that robert anton uh, not robert uh, paul, paul craig roberts has by the way okay